Now one and two. And of course, any time he gets two strikes on the hitter, crowd immediately hoping and sensing for another strikeout. Ground ball wide, a third. Nice pick there for the play at first. So Rutledge taps to third. Uribe gets in. Fowler advances to second. And Carlos Gonzalez coming up. Gonzalez homered on a one and two pitch in the first inning. And then walked last time up in the fourth. Cargo, as they call him all the time in Denver. They might need cargo. If I understood the weather today, they're talking about heavy snowstorms in and around Colorado. All in one. Gonzalez although he hits for an average, swings at a lot of pitches out of the strike zone. One one. Two years ago, they did a survey on Gonzalez, and he swung at 37% of the pitches that were outside the strike zone. However, a career batting average of 299, so he can flat out hit no matter what he does. He's got two gold gloves, 2010 and last year. In 2011, he signed a seven-year deal. And for good measure, he hit for the cycle back in 2010. Well, he was trying to hit that thing with Pasadena. Two and two to count. Two years ago, Gonzalez hit 34 home runs. Last year, 22. Out on. Six runs, 11 hits for the Dodgers. One run, two hits for the Rockies. The man from Maracaibo in Venezuela, Carlos Gonzalez. He'll be 28 in October. Just off the corner. Naturally, the crowd wants everything. Especially, especially those from South Korea. Three and two. Strikeouts are expensive. A lot easier for a pitcher to get somebody hit the first pitch and make an out. There goes the runner, and it is ball four. And we're watching the plate umpire and 